so students today we read a poem the name of the poem is a watering rhyme so this poem is from marigold book class 3 so now we read a poem the name of the poem is a watering rhyme okay now early in the morning or in the evening hour at the times to water every kind of flower so early in the morning or the evening hour at the times to water every kind of flower watering at noon day when the sun is high doesn't help the flowers only makes them die also when you water water at the roots flowers keep their mouths where we shoot wherever boots soak the earth around them then through all the heat the flowers will have water for their thirsty feet so this is a nice poem a watering rhyme so i think you all should love this poem uh, now uh, here the poem p a ropes who uh, the author who write this poem says that early in the morning or in the evening hour at the time so that we give water to the flower he was asking to us that in the morning or in the evening at the time to water the flower or we should water the flower at the noon day when the sun is high so the poet is asking this and he said that doesn't help the flowers only makes them die and the poet is now telling that um, uh, that uh, watering at noon day when the sun is high doesn't help the flowers only makes them die so the poet is telling that that at the noon time when the sun is high in our head uh, at the overhead when the sun is high at that time it doesn't help the flowers okay uh, if we water them so, and it will only make those flowers die so he is asking that whether early in the morning or in the evening hour at the times to water the flower and he was also telling that when we water the flower then we should water the plant at the roots because flower keeps their mouths where we should wear our boots so when we water the flower we should water at the roots of the plant because flower keep their mouths where we should wear our boots so soak the earth around them at the root we should keep water because the water soak the earth around the root and make the plant uh, uh, throughout water so then through all the heat the flowers will have water for their thirsty feet so if we flower the if we water the flower or the plant at the roots then through all through the heat the flower will get water for their thirsty feet okay so this is the poem uh, this is a nice poem you all should read this poem